Welcome back everybody to the greatest show on earth and that is the Miami Boat Ramps channel and today we are visiting Black Point Marina. Cap is coming in hot. This boat looks good like it just got refinished too. So Cap brake checks it. Wind and current grabs them just a little bit. So Cap's going to try backing down on this one. Um, oh, oh no, Cap! He hits the throttle. Are they going to run up the ramp? Oh my, Cap's going to recover this. I thought for sure they were running up the ramp, and I was going to feel bad because this boat looks like it just got completely redone. So Cap's got it back under control. Just a little whiskey throttle action. We're going to change the side the lines are on, though, and get this thing tied up and put away. That one was about as close of a call as you have down here at Black Point. I thought for sure when I saw that throttle action, we were going to get some real action with this boat. And our guy's pushing off the dock, and he looks like he's ready to roll. Looks like he's got a pretty good line. Oh! Oh no! He smacked the bow stop. I couldn't tell if the truck moved back into him a little bit. It might have been one of those moments where somebody had it in park and didn't take their foot off the brake and right before he hit, because it looked like it just came back just a few inches. Man, he smacked it solid. Let me know if this is a Guggen of the Week moment. Something we should put over on our Drain Plug Mafia channel. And if you haven't subscribed over there, please go over there and check it out. If you liked the stuff we did on Broncos Guru, you will love what we're doing over there as well. And there we go. We get the light toss, and this crew is going to come in right behind them. But Cap in front of them is not happy. Our crew behind them even had the lines and everything ready. I mean, these guys are prepped. It looks like Cap's out of the boat now in front of them, so he's going to go up there and get this one winched up and be on his way. And our guys finally got this on the trailer, and this crew looks like they're about ready for the pullout. And here we go. Oh no, they didn't lock the winch. The boat's coming off. Everybody yells for him to stop. That was close. Thankfully, he was pulling out slow. If he would have been like really on the throttle on this one, we might have had a boat sitting on the ramp. So it looks like Cap's gonna back down again. We're going to try and get this one resituated. But here comes the real question on this one. Did they forget to lock the winch? Or is the winch broken? I don't know if you guys have ever had that happen. I've had it happen once where actually the winch strap snapped. And you want to talk about a fun time at the boat ramp trying to get a boat back out of the water with no winch strap. And these guys are up here messing with it, but I got a feeling this thing's broken. I don't know that the strap broke, but something's wrong with the winch because they're not... It's not happening quickly. This is taking a little time for them to get this thing put up here. So our guy's trying to teach Wifey how to back the trailer down. But he's doing it at Black Point on a weekend. Whoa, this truck's going to try and squeeze past her. And now he's really relegated the space that she's got to move. So they're going to back up just a little bit to give her a little more room. Oh, 
Oh, yep, she's about to jackknife it. She's gonna have to stop. And this truck's back in her space again. She should just probably let them go around. But nope, we're gonna reset it one more time. She's got a good start approach from right here, though. A little better than where she's been. So maybe this will be the time she can bring it home. There you go, you got a good look. And she's gonna stop one more time, but our guy's gonna be able to sneak by this time. She's probably gonna have to straighten it out one more time. No, nope, she's gonna keep coming back. There we go. Get it a little straight, and she should be good to roll from here. It's always nice to see people learning to back up a trailer, but the reality is you don't want to do it at a boat ramp like Black Point on a weekend. But it'll turn out okay here, and Wifey gets it back down pretty solid. And she stayed patient. I mean, there's, there's a lot going on down here, and that can get people frustrated real quickly. I mean, you can hear horns blaring, and they're not blaring at her. And she looks like she's got it lined up right this time. And this should be good to roll. And our crew's getting ready to make their approach. Wifey's getting the lines on the ready. And Cap's gonna make his turn in on the dock. Gives a little brake check, taking the slow roll approach, which is always a good thing around here. And the wind and current's kind of giving him a little fit. He is making the tougher approach, trying to dock into it. And every time you do a brake check on that, the boat's just gonna wanna drift off the dock a little more. And Wifey looks like she's ready for a toss. Just gotta get the bow close enough. And here we go, Cap's gonna start trying to nudge that in. Oh, and we're pulling back off. Wifey goes for the toss, she's gonna miss. The bow's coming back out, she goes for toss number two and we'll get the assist off the dock. And Cap's gonna leave the helm and pull it in and that'll be enough to get them done. Thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Miami Boat Ramps. If you did, please check out our other content. We have Wavy Boats, who does a bunch of great things down at Holliver Inlet. We have my channel, the Drain Plug Mafia channel, where we do a bunch of comedy boating videos there as well. And of course, we've got Boats vs. Hallover, where Man and Machine take on Mother Nature down at Hallover Inlet. And if you guys haven't already, go ahead and drop an anchor on the subscribe button here.